But what is going on today, beautiful people? Welcome back to another episode of Fishing with Flim. I should have said good morning because it is early. The sun is just now coming up. But man, today, man, y'all in for a special treat. I'm gonna do my first fishing challenge on the channel today, man. Yes, I'm gonna do the $25 Walmart fishing challenge. So I'm gonna go into Walmart, I'm walking in Walmart right now. I'm gonna try to film, but I get camera shy around people. But um, so the point of the video is get some baits and get some things that I think will catch fish. And I only have $25. So it's a $25 budget fishing challenge, man. We're gonna go in here and see, I got my mask and we're gonna go in here and see what I can pick. I kind of got a few baits in mind, but I don't know the price of them. So we're gonna get in here, we're gonna see. I'm gonna try my best to film as much of it as I can. So if I'm talking a little low or anything like that, or you know, it looks a little sketchy, and you know, I'm gonna get in and get out. So I'll see you guys inside. Let's go. People, I survived. Um, <laughs> I passed the first test. Like, I did it. I really did it. But um, I'm back in the car, man. And um, I will show you guys the receipt, but I actually had just bought a car mount so I can actually do better with making videos because I'm always making intros and stuff in the car, intros and outros in the car. So, um, this mount itself cost $12.98. But as I was rigging, ringing everything up, all the fishing stuff up, the fishing stuff came out to $24.10. Man, I think we did really good. And I think we can catch some fish on some of these baits. Obviously, it's a little later in the morning now, so I don't know if I'll be able to catch them on every bait, but we gonna try. So the first thing I did get, I got the black trick worms. I don't know how long these are, but these are all, obviously the longer and bigger ones, they have smaller ones about half this size. So black trick worms, those things were like $3. Next, I got the Lunker Hunt Finesse Swim Bait, man. Uh, three inches, little paddle tail swim baits on there, on a little Ned rig, that'll definitely get munched. Um, I got the Ozark Trail uh, prop bait, the Whopper Plopper. You guys probably can't see this good because of the sun, but I got that. And I think I'm most excited about this one, the corporate worm, the curly tail uh, worm that's red and blue, man. It's freaking dope. Fire and Ice, that's a dope name, I like that. I think the hooks is what set it off. These hooks was about two, two or three dollars, but uh, these are for soft plastic worm hooks uh three odd yeah just the everyday thing and then i finally got me an all white chatter bait i don't know if you guys can see that all white chatter bait man there you go so yeah man we're gonna throw these around today a little bit and see what kind of fish we can get man but um yeah man like and subscribe for more content if you like the walmart challenges let me know in the comment section what kind of challenges you want you want to see next on the channel because there's a ton of stuff in walmart to make challenges about and this is my first one so i'm excited but i'm not going to do too much more talking let's just go ahead and get straight to the video man i'll see you guys out there on the water on the gopro baby y'all stay safe let's go all right you guys i'm all rigged up so i think i got about six total so this is these three so i have the black um <laughs> the trick worms which i already have tied on i got a 316 ounce Wu tungsten weight on. Then you have the culprit curly, the culprit curly tail worm, 7.5 inch fire. Then I also have these. I don't have these rigged up. I have my spinning rod in the car, but I'm not rigged up with these yet. I'm gonna see how, if I can figure out the bite before I, I try these, but, cause I already got three other rods hooked, um, hooked up. So that's three. Obviously this is on this. Uh, let me go ahead and put this in here. I also have the Z-Man uh, original chatterbait tied on. I got my own little paddle tail, white paddle tail swim bait that kind of matched the hatch. I don't know. I'm not 100% sure um, that I'll catch a fish on this, but I do have it tied on. I am going to throw it around a little bit. And I also have the Whopper Plopper on Ozark Trail. This is Walmart's brand, man. So there's what, six, seven baits, seven baits, including, well, the hook counts as seven. So outside of the hooks, I have six baits. And um, I don't know, man, we're just gonna fish and see what we can get. This stuff costs me $24.10 to be exact. $24.10, man, you can't, that's so close to 25. I probably could have got, I don't know, 
I don't know what else I could have got to be honest. I've been fiending for that top water blow up. That's one reason why I did pick um, top water. I've been fiending for it. But we're going to see if we can get it. Oh, got one. Got one. It wasn't a big top water blow up, but I got one still. Stay on, baby. Stay on, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Man, as I was saying, I've been fiending for it. Let's go, man. Let's freaking go. That's one freaking bait down. Oh my gosh, hopefully this guy don't shake. <sighs> don't shake, man. Ah, uh, no, 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 come back, come back. No, no. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you for playing, baby. Thank you. Thank you. That was second cast over here. Dude, I'm about to I'm about to make a few more casts before I switch up, man. Before I switch up to anything else. It was a small guy, it wasn't a big top water blow up. But hey, that's on the Walmart brand, the Ozark Trail Whopper Plopper. This is a little translucent color. I've never used it before. Like I was saying before, my boy Cameron use it a lot and i do like how subtle it is you know normal whopper poppers are like really really loud and which is a good thing it calls those fish in but sometimes the best thing to do is throw a little more subtle approach so i'm glad to be able to add this to my arsenal shout out to my boy camera because he throws it all the time but man that was my first fish one bait down dog i'm gonna make a couple more casts and just just to see Welcome back, people. It is day two of the uh, $25 Walmart budget fishing challenge, man. Um, I'm just kind of giving you guys an update. Um, the first day, not not too much happened, man. I, I really thought I was going to be able to knock off uh, two of the bottom baits, but I wasn't. So it is actually the next morning. Um, and I'm about to go out here to a different pond to see if I can knock off the rest of these baits. I'm, I'm pretty confident about today. Yesterday, I got a real late start. So I knew fishing was gonna be tough. So I didn't have the most confidence, but today I'm confident. Um, may not, may not get a fish on every single lure, but I am going to try my best, you guys. I am going to grind today, man. But we gonna see how this goes, man. If you guys haven't already, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment, man, for future um, content, man. And I actually have a giveaway coming up. So y'all just stay tuned for all of those things, man. Let's get back to this video. Got one. Yes, on the <laughs> red and blue corporate worm. Let's go. Oh! The... The... No, man. He hit the top of the water and I literally cast at him. He hit it as soon as it freaking <sighs> hit the water, man. I don't care, man. This this challenge is rough, dog. Like, that counts. I don't care. That counts. They're out deeper. I've been fishing shallow forever trying to, you know, get on like a normal pattern. And that fish uh, came to the top and he's definitely deeper than I normally fish. Oh my gosh, and he came off. <sighs> he came off. That was my first bite, man. First freaking bite in two days. On the worm. Oh, got one. Oh, bad. Oh. He Oh my gosh! <gasps> Yo, y'all saw that. It jumped out the water right at my feet. Oh my goodness, that's that's two fish. I'm the king of losing fish. I'm about to change my YouTube name to Losing Fish with Flim or something. I don't know. Man, this is that's two. That would have been the top water would have been down the corporate worm and the hook would have been down that's three and then um 
this would have been down a paddle tail swim bait so that would have been four baits and i have six but what's the other one oh chatter bait and a black worm and i know eventually i'll get a hit on the black worm the chatter bait was the only one that i was concerned about simply because it's a white chatter bait and i don't really throw white chatter baits because i'm fishing ponds and these ponds don't don't have shad main forage always is is bluegill and things like that so ah. I'm telling you guys hey i'm out here i'm trying oh my god i lost two fish man i'm gonna fish this thing a little bit more and see if i can get any more bites on it but if not i'm gonna have to switch it up and just keep moving and those two fish that i lost they're gonna have to count today but I, I promise i promise i am going to to try my best to get a fish on these lures oh yeah top water it is No, I ain't see that. I might to get in there. I might hit the third spot trying to complete this challenge. I've already caught a fish on this waffle popper, but this place is too juicy not to throw top water. So we're going to start out top water and just see if we can catch some fish on this thing again. I hope so. Coming by this tree. Yeah, this the Walmart brand, the Ozark Trail. Yeah. Yes, sir. Got one. Yes, sir. He killed it. Come here. Stay down. Stay down. He killed it. He killed it just now. Oh, he's oh my god, he's pulling good. Come here. Oh, he's stuck in something. Come out. He's stuck. Come out. He's stuck in, I don't know, I guess the tree over here or something. I don't even feel him no more, dog. Oh my god. I don't, I don't feel him at all. He got me in a tree though. Oh my goodness, dog. I don't think he on. I don't think he on there no more. Damn, I don't think he on there no more. Oh my god, I can't even see the tree. Dang, dog. I was, I was reeling him in, but he was, he was in there. Dang. He, I'm talking about, he killed it, dog. That was probably, the, that would have been my biggest fish on the top water, for sure. That wasn't no small fish. Oh my gosh. Oh, I got my bait back. I did, yep. Yeah, it's good, it's good out of you, oh, bro, I'm shaking, dog. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Oh my gosh. The Ozark Trail Whopper Plop. I know you guys saw that on the camera. Oh my God, it caught me all off guard. That caught me all off guard, dog. First fish of the day on the uh, chatterbait. Stay on, baby. Stay on, baby. Let's go. Come on, man. I done lost too many fish lately. Off this structure. Why are they fighting so hard in here? Oh, my God. Come here. Come here, boy. Come here, boy. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Yes, sir. These guys in here are freaking strong, dog. He wanted this thing, you guys. Let's 
Look at this, man. First fish of the day. Came on a <laughs> Walmart chatterbait. Well, the Z-Man chatterbait, man. This is just white, and it got a white paddle tail swim bait to go on the back of it to match the hatch. But beautiful fish, man. Look at this bad boy. That's, that's a pounder. I'll, 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 literally, every time I catch a fish, I always say a pounder. But this is definitely a pounder. Pound and a quarter, man. Beautiful fish. Let's go, man. I think we figured out something. That was like my second or third cast in there with it. We're going to get this beautiful girl back out here in this pond, man. Hopefully, that's more where that came from. Let's go, baby. And she just swims off so gracefully back where she came from let's go man well people that is gonna do it for today's video man i actually forgot to film my outro for this video it's been like two or three days and i was on the computer and i was editing and i was like wait i didn't feel film my outro so this is what i'm doing now man but just a little recap um it took what two three days it took three different days and i believe about three or four different ponds to complete the challenge and te I, honestly i really didn't complete the challenge because for some reason i could not get a bite on the black uh trick worm i don't know if it was because i got the bigger size trick worm or they just wasn't feeling any bottom baits but the three places i went um had no luck on the trick worm but outside of that i think i did a pretty good job i'm not gonna say i complete the challenge because technically i didn't but it definitely boosted my confidence because i caught fish or lost fish on things that for one i've never used before and for two i didn't have any confidence in like the white chatterbait don't have confidence confidence in it because it, it just resembles like a shad and the bodies of waters i fish i don't think they have shad i've never seen shad main forge is always blue kill where i fish at so i didn't have confidence in that that red and blue worm i didn't have confidence in that and i never fished it before those colors so yeah man I, thank you guys for tuning in and watching another video if you guys want to see more content like this the, the fishing challenges you know maybe i can do academy next maybe i can do a bass pro shop next a budget 50 dollars, whatever the case may be you guys get in the comment section below you guys set the price you guys let me know what kind of challenges you want to see next and i'll try my best to complete these challenges man this was something different on my channel and i just want to thank you guys for watching be sure to like this video subscribe and comment man i appreciate all the love and support that you guys have um giving me so far continue to rock with me the content gonna be better and better and better but as always man y'all stay safe y'all stay beautiful and i'm out peace